The Shadow Cabinet have asked me to come and have a word with you, Jeremy. Oh, yes? So they've agreed to back me on not bombing Syria, have they? Their position is the same as when Thursday's meeting broke up. The majority feel they cannot support you on this. Diane, I wonder if I could ask you to have a seat outside for a moment. Look, you stupid bastard, over 60% of the party support me. I've got the biggest fucking mandate in the history of the Labour Party, for Christ's sake. What the fuck do you expect me to do? It's supposed to be your job to get the bastards on my side. That email you sent after the meeting didn't help. I'm trying to run a credible opposition. You couldn't run a fucking whelk store, for Christ's sake. I never wanted this fucking job, you know, but now I've got it, I'm going to make bloody sure I take Labour back to being a proper left-wing party again, and not a load of fucking quasi-Tories. My support from party members has gone up since the summer. How dare these mutinous bastards go against me? Jeremy. I appoint the Shadow Cabinet, for Christ's sake. They don't appoint the leader, and I made you deputy because I thought you were on my side. Then what the fuck do you do? You only stand up at the meeting to say you thought Cameron made a compelling case for going to war. Jeremy, the feeling is you're becoming a liability, and that it's time for you to do the honourable thing. I'll leave you now to think it over.